Welcome everyone, and in this video we're going to kind of go over my process and how I'm going to keep my studying organized. Now some people just use like a, like a Word document, Excel maybe, but I find probably the best one that I found was Notion. Notion is probably one of the best, I don't say notes, it's a, it's a database software, but I think it allows you to organize stuff very nicely and you can search stuff pretty easily and actually have stuff linked together. So. Let's go ahead and dive into my process or my little notes um, overview. And this might give you some ideas to how to um, set up Notion if you want to do that. So let's do that. So this is basically my chess homepage. Um, it's very simple. Um, just a couple of um, databases, tables in here that I use, um, a couple links. Um, but it just allows me to kind of keep stuff organized a little bit. Um, so the first thing is books. This is just um, maybe there's a, a book I'm reading or a article that I'm reading that I want to highlight something in here and just keep a note of. Then I can just do that. Um, then it just kind of um, allows me to kind of go back to it. So let me try to find where it's at the page. I can find it right here. Um, it, the tags here will allow me to kind of organize between either uh, a book or an article. So. The next thing is kind of the master part, which I probably should move it up, but this is where I'm keeping pretty much all my learning um, stuff in here. So this is going to be um, openings, defenses, uh, notes on my games, um, and as well as historic games I can pick up and put in here and maybe add some notes to as well. So it'll help me study certain things. So. We see got these different here, which I kind of started learning a little bit, but nothing too serious. Um, these are some historic games here um, that I want to kind of read about. Um, these rapid games are basically my games. So basically what I do is I go into chess.com um, and basically share that analysis from that to this, um, which I can show you guys in another video how to do that. It's pretty simple. Um, Basically, even though even from my phone, I can actually send it to Notion and have it there, and I can copy it later. Um, chess game history. This is where I would bring it in. These this will be the raw um, move list from Chess.com. Um, this is something I'm working on, just kind of playing around with certain items. So we we can go in that um, chess study schedule. This is where I want to put how I'm studying for today, what I'm going to study for the day in here. Um, this is um kind of notes. I don't know why this is the title, but. Let's go to a quick one here. Which you know what? Let's go to the chess game history. So this is like my personal game. So this is where I kind of keep them here. Um, if I open this up, you can see um, it's, this is basically just straight from chess.com. This is just um, the moves here. So what I do is here, I'll grab this, I'll copy this from here, go into chess.com, and I would then add it down here into one of these games here. Um, let's grab this one. Open this. Expand that. At some point, there we go, there we go. So in this here, it tells me what color I'm playing, uh, the day of the game, if I, my outcome, but when I lost, and this stuff here. This is for other stuff, for like um, tournament game if I'm playing over the board. I can't copy or take a picture of the scoreboard of the, uh, the notes and put it here. Um, basically, this this date player's game. Here's like the a table version of the list um, with some game notes and maybe some player notes on it. Um, some scoring. If I will put some analysis on it, um, which I'll show you a quick way in another video on how I do this uh, or ways to do this. Um, and here's a hyperlink to the actual moves. So I what is actually a hyperlink to too, so I can go back here if I need to copy something over I can't. So that's basically how I'm more using Notion um, to do this um, in having different filters and settings. Um, if you want, make a comment down below if you want me to do a full um, tutorial on how to set this up. It's actually very simple. Um, if you're not used to Notion, um, there might be another video in the future I'd make. So yeah, again, this is just a quick overview of my Notion, basically layout for chess and i hope you guys enjoyed it please hit the subscribe button also hit the like um, notification bell for when new videos pop up 
And always, I'll see you guys in the next one.